All right, hey guys, OFD checking in here, and today we've got a watch from Call Watches out of Singapore. I want to thank Ivan at Three Hand Media for sending this one over for me to take a look at. It will be going over to Chris Marshall over at Marshall Time. I'll leave both links to their YouTube channels down below in the description. So, all right, guys, this is a super cool one. They have three models in this new uh, multiverse series or multiverse series. Uh, very cool watches. This is the Earth model. Uh, they're also going to do a moon and a sun model, um, but the watches are just really, really cool design. Now, I'm going to ask your forgiveness right up front because this watch has this huge domed sapphire crystal on it, and guys, it's going to pick up reflections all over the place, but I'm going to do my absolute best to show you what I can with this watch. You guys can see it's picking up all the lighting, uh, my studio lighting I use here in the room, but super cool watch. So you guys can obviously tell here this is a space-themed watch. This is what they wanted to go for the, with these watches. They're using this bridge uh, to suspend this half globe over the dial here. Now, the this, like I said, this is the Earth model, so the Moon model is going to have a suspended Moon. The Sun model is going to have a red suspended Sun over there each one representative of each of those different watches now first thing you're gonna say is how the heck am I supposed to read this watch well it's actually pretty simple guys so uh, you can see up here it's at 10 o'clock so right there lets you know it's 10 o'clock and then it's hiding right over here under the bridge so I'm gonna actually stop the movement on the watch and kind of move it around so you can see it but you see that little star that North Star that is your minute hand so right here it lets you know that it's about 10.05 right here on the watch. And then there's a little satellite moving around the earth here. You can see that that's your second hand. So it, it, once you figure out how to read this watch, it's really, really simple to, ease, uh, to read. This bridge is actually, like I said, holding the half globe there over the top of it. So definitely a space themed watch, something that honestly, if you get one of these watches on your wrist, you're gonna have people asking about it quite a bit just because it's such a unique design. Honestly, something I would love to have in the collection just because it's so different and so unique. Um, the case size on these watches is really usable. It's a 42 millimeter case from side to side, 47 lug to lug, 22 millimeter lug openings. Where it gets gigantic is with 19 millimeters of thickness. Now, I will tell you that five of those millimeters are this domed crystal on the watch. Obviously, it needs to be that big to kind of make room for the bridge and the half the half globe down inside of there. But it's a really, really cool looking watch. You can see the crown here is signed with the Call logo there. Call, by the way, means time in Sanskrit. I didn't mention that to you. They've used these screws here on the side of the case. I'm going to bring it up here a little closer so you can see that have this star pattern in the top of them also. So, uh, you know, letting you know about the star. And then if you see at each of the lugs, at the top of each of the four lugs, you get this almost like shooting star or meteorite look there on the watch. So definitely going for a lot of this space theme here on the watch. Um, the So so the uh, hour ring there is actually translucent or, um, yeah, see-through. And you've got what I think is a venturing, a venturing stone underneath there that makes up the main dial. And that's where you get those little star effects that you can see there underneath. It's a really, really cool looking, fun little watch. Love the way that satellite moves around there for the second hand. So cool looking stuff. They're going to have these guys over at the website. They've launched these in September at the website. You can jump on them for a pre-order of uh, $369, which is a great deal for the watch. These are running a Seiko NH35 movement, by the way. So show you, actually, I didn't show you guys the case back. But yeah, they're going to be starting out at $369 over there at the website. If you pre-order from the website, you've got this constellation here on the back. You've got the little see-through there for the balance wheel that you can see moving around in there. Pretty cool. But yeah, uh, 369 starting out. Kickstarter, there'll be early bird of 399 And then eventually the regular price on these will go up to $699. A little bit steep, but it's a whole lot of neat watch you get um, when you're buying one of these call multiverse. So, all right, let's pause it. Get this watch on my 7-inch wrist. And I'm not sure if there's any loom, but we'll definitely check at the end. All right, so being a 42 millimeter case, the watch fits my wrist extremely well, especially 47 lug tip to lug tip. The real only big elephant in the room is the domed crystal on the watch, but really it looks cool. And that's what's going to draw a little bit more attention to this watch, especially with that globe under there. Now, whether you go for the, the earth, the uh, moon or the sun, I think they're all really, really neat models available. So definitely go over there and check them out at the website. I'll leave a link down below in the bottom. So let's kill the lights and see what kind of loom this one has. All right, guys, so I kind of cheated a little bit and hit it with the flashlight first just to see what the loom looks like. And man, is it cool on this watch, guys. I had a feeling it would be really wild, and um, that's it. I mean, look at how it actually lights up the edge of the earth there, like at the at the horizon. That is so stinking cool. I really like it. Super legible, super easy to tell the time. You've got that North Star 
really bright over here at almost the, it's like the 1009 position but that is super super cool all right guys this has been the call multiverse if you guys like the video give me a thumbs up down there at the bottom and if you've not subscribed to the ofd channel yet please do please do thanks guys